so let me give you guys some background on my natural hair journey so it started about three to four years ago I got my well I started cutting off the straight hair because I had been relaxing my hair for so many years and my hair was breaking off falling out because I was gluing it in and not the cap gluing method that I talked about before I was actually gluing it in my hair for years through high school after college I was doing all of that and I was just ruining my hair I went and I got a big chop like completely cut all my hair off because I had seen this Rihanna video that had, when it had just come out and I decided that I wanted to have my hair like Rihanna so I went and got this haircut and I hated it because it didn't fit me because my hair my face is very chubby and I don't, short hair is just not for me like really short hair is not for me so I went and started weaving it again the same way but it was growing back totally different you know it was growing back more in its natural state so I let it grow out but I kept relaxing relaxing it and about two to three years ago I went and I cut off all of the relaxed relaxed straight hair and um, I cut it down to the curly hair and once I did that I just started to let my hair grow out for about two to three years so about every three two to three months I get a trim so and I usually do it myself I usually cut my own hair and um, I've noticed that lately over the past year or so my edges have been thinning out from doing even the glue in on a cap method because the cap has to stick on my head somehow because I have paper underneath so it doesn't obviously stay on this part of my head it stays around the perimeter which are the edges and it um, has been thinning it out like it doesn't rip my hair out but just the tension on there you know and the glue and then I have to comb out the little pieces of glue that might be on the round the edges so it does like kind of it doesn't damage it so much it's just really thinning out and then but me by me putting heat on it from having to straighten my edges because I'm not relaxing my hair anymore me straightening it has totally shortened them so if you can see the front of my hair is really short and so are the sides so when I went today for my first Dominican blowout I actually had to get a nice lecture from the hairdresser she actually told me she's like listen no more heat no more none of that crap you've been doing to your edges and things like that because she's gonna help me grow them back out so if you guys know of any type of product that I can use to help grow my edges out please let me know I actually have been using coconut oil and it's been working really really well I drink a lot of water and I take a lot of biotin um, every day well not a lot but I take biotin every day and it's really worked with growing my hair out my hair is actually a lot healthier and longer than it's ever been since I was probably a little girl so I'm really 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 excited about it I love how it's just so flowy I mean I always would take my sisters and I would go with all my girlfriends to get blowouts from the Dominicans but I've never gotten one so I'm always like I want one I want one but my hair was never long enough in my opinion to get it done so finally I went there today got a blowout and I'm obsessed with it if you can't already tell my hands are just all in my hair it is it does look very thin because I'm just not used to my hair being this flat on my head and my roots are super straight so it does seem if to me it feels a little thin but it's healthy so I'm not complaining I, I, I really like the outcome I love what she did so yeah I just wanted to give you guys a nice little natural hair update I'm gonna show you guys the length so we're gonna do a real quick length check in the back I don't know if you guys can see this but see the flowiness of it it's just really 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 nice like I'm loving it and she did cut my hair um, she cut about an inch off because it was very uneven from me just doing my own trims <laughs> so yeah um, I needed it. it was definitely worth it I really really like the outcome so I wanted to just do a really quick like natural hair length check update with you guys I will probably do this more often because I'm actually going to start wearing my natural hair in videos um, I just I'm it's too hot it's really too hot for weave right now in my opinion I might go a little bit longer and do a sew-in maybe with like a 12 or 14 inch I just kind of want more of the shorter hair look I've just been feeling that a little bit lately so I might go in with that I might start wearing clip-ins I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do yet um, clip-ins seems more realistic but because I hate sitting for sew-in I hate it it just drives me nuts it's so just I hate sew-ins I mean I don't mind it when it's done but just the process like to me a quick weave glue in on a cap is so easy and so quick but the problem with that is it's just it's 
it's it itches <laughs> like crazy and in the summertime it's too hot to be having a whole cap on your head and trying to scratch it and sometimes I just want to be able to get up and go sometimes I want to throw my hair up in a ponytail and leave and you know with the weave that's not put in that way maybe with a sew-in you can do that but with a glue-in cap you can't and I don't know how to sew in hair unfortunately guys I can't braid I'm not a person that knows how to do cornrows I could braid my hair but it wouldn't be tight like I would want it to be so I try not to try a sew-in like I just don't do it and I know there's like the no braid sew-in method there's so many different sew-in methods but I personally just don't prefer sew-in um I might get one I'm not exactly sure we'll see it's just a lot of work in my opinion I'm lazy when it comes to like installing my hair so if I do get a sew-in I will go somewhere or have someone do it maybe my mom will do it for me I'm not exactly sure yet but I will definitely keep you guys posted um I'll let you guys know more about my hair as we go along so thank you for watching this video and I hope you guys are excited as I am about this natural hair journey that I'm on I can't wait to see how much longer my hair is gonna get because it's growing so nicely so yeah I love you guys thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys later bye